biscuits cause it's King Biscuit Time on KFFA Radio. KFFA was founded in 1941 and about two days after it was founded, King Biscuit Time came on the show. Ladies and gentlemen, Robert Jr. Lockwood and the King Biscuit Entertainers. It was a new radio station built by entrepreneurs. One of them came to run it. His name was Sam Anderson. Sam had been watching a new radio station being put together at uh, Paragould, Arkansas. And from seeing that, he decided he wanted to go into radio. He came and, and to Helena, Arkansas and saw this vibrant little uh, river city uh, with a lot of commerce, a lot of businesses. Uh, doing pretty well for uh, the end of the Depression right before uh, World War II hit, and uh, he wanted to be a part of it. Hi everyone, Sunshine John, Sonny Payne, broadcasting live from the Delta Cultural Center, right here in the historic downtown Helena, program number 17,662. Oh, hey, how about that? Sonny Boy Williamson opens our show Work with me right here. Do your thing. I met Sonny when I, I first began uh, working at the Delta Cultural Center. I was the uh, I was the uh, promotional person, the uh, communications coordinator. They needed somebody to take over a. Uh, yeah. a a radio program we did called Delta Sounds and, and still do the program which looks at all the music from all the different genres of the Delta. Sonny and I got to know each other a lot better. Mom and I will work with you. I'll try to make it so pleasant for you, darling. Tell you and don't know what to do. Sonny's 91 years old. He is uh, he's had better health. Uh, but he's had much worse health, but he is a, a determined old cuss at, at most times, and uh, he enjoys being a part of his community through radio, uh, and, and Sonny uh, has a sense of responsibility along those lines, and, it, and it's very apparent. It's not overtly stated most of the time, but Sonny believes in what he does and he does it very well. And uh, we hope he will continue to do it for some time. 